the rematch of rematches, John Cena, Roman Reigns. We're going to be discussing AJ Styles hinting at his WWE run ending. Triple H gives an update on the future of World Wrestling Entertainment, the UK division. Natalia confirmed as the fifth member of SmackDown Live. We're going to be discussing James Ellsworth, Survivor Series, Nakamura. We got a lot to settle the score on the brash and brazen. Sean's Entertainment, quite frankly, I will not be overtaken. Keep it prolific, consistent, and dedicated. John Cena's match at the upcoming WWE live event Madison Square Garden, New York City. The Hallett Halls in Madison Square Garden. Ladies and gentlemen, December the 26th has changed. A huge match is now going to take place. Cena, who was originally scheduled to wrestle Samoa Joe, will now be facing the big dog of the Shield, Roman Reigns, in a rematch from their very prestigious and highly talked about WWE No Mercy Clash this past September. Reigns would go on to defeat John Cena in their first meeting. Viewers and subscribers at Survivor Series. Monday Night Raw is expected to come out ahead in the matchups at Survivor Series. With SmackDown likely taking the men's elimination match. But Raw taking the women's elimination match. There is rumors of a huge money in the bank cash in at Survivor Series. According to James McKenna on Wrestling Sheet Radio. At one point WWE had the idea. The motive of doing Charlotte versus James Ellsworth for the Women's Championship at WrestleMania. Obviously, with James Ellsworth released, that will be happening anytime like next year. What's more, WWE apparently, Vince McMahon apparently had major plans for James Ellsworth by having Ellsworth become a transgender. Well, that would have been different. That would have been something. You know, remember when they were talking about Brock Lesnar playing um, uh, a, a gay character? And look, like I said, I, I have nothing against race color, origin, a, I, I don't, you know, what, no matter where you're coming from, what you do, what you're about, as long as you're watching the show on View Entertainment, that's what it's all about. But uh, viewers and subscribers, huge update on WrestleMania 34. Two huge SmackDown Live stars are going to settle the score. Shitsuke Nakamura versus AJ Styles could very well already be in place for WrestleMania 34, and that would not be a damn disgrace. Scott Dawson could be back before the end of the year, per the observer of the revival. Now, Triple H commented on Kurt Angle and, you know, the intrigue of those two combating in a match one-on-one. -on -one. Would I love to get in the ring with Kurt and do something with Kurt, said Triple H. Absolutely, Triple H said. If it's right, if it's right for everybody, if he continues to want to stay in the ring, if I do too, if it's right for everybody, absolutely. Kurt's one of the best ever, and I don't know that I've ever seen anybody pick it up as fast and become so good so fast. As Kurt Angle. When AJ Styles viewers was asked if his family gets angry with how much he's on the road, he noted that he's been marked, and excuse me, he's been married. Well, he has been pretty marked too. He's been a marked man. He's been married for 17 years, and his wife has been getting mad at him the entire time because he's always on the road away from his family, away from his kids. He talked about having four children and often having to discipline them over the phone, but that will change in a couple of years. So AJ Styles hinting at leaving at going away. AJ Styles, you know, said the following about his WWE future and his WWE career. Work hard now, you enjoy it later, Styles said. In a couple of years, I'll be able to catch every football game, every ba baseball game, every basketball game, cheerleading, gymnastics, whatever they're in. So I guess AJ Styles' kids must be taking up some kind of sports and perhaps gymnastics. Now, when the host stated that they didn't want Styles to retire in a couple of years, AJ Styles replied, man, I'm 40 years old. Uh, when the host, you know, and you know, the thing is, AJ Styles, I mean, one of the, one of the most phenomenalist WWE champions we have seen in a long time. And a partial source, and source goes uh, according to Wrestling Inc. and uh, The Independent, because Triple H spoke with The Independent on a number of topics, including the future of the WWE's UK division. He talked about how it takes time to put together a division and hoped that things would have come together a bit quicker. Um, Pete Dunne and all of those UK guys are very talented, Triple H said. Putting together a product of a in a television show and live events in the UK and doing what we do takes time. I would love for this to have happened quicker and sooner, but we are where we are. And Triple H continued that he expects something more consistent to come together to the division in the near future with many of the talents training in Orlando, Florida at the WWE Performance Center. But as it concerns AJ Styles' stint coming to an end, you know, viewers and subscribers, you know, you got to wonder, AJ Styles, he's been in it for a long time. You know, you're talking WCW, you're talking TNA. AJ Styles came in at the late end of his career in his life. And 
and the fact that AJ Styles, you know, he's won it all, he has done it all. I mean, if AJ Styles wanted to go off in the sunset and only have a one-year run, he could have left, but AJ Styles has given us more. He's given us more spectacular moments. He's given us more intrigue. He's, he's stepping it up. He's bringing it up a notch. I mean, AJ Styles has already put together, you know, a number of great matches, and, you know, who can fault him for that? And the fact that he's been away from his family and his kids for so long, you know, you can't be stingy. You know, you, you know... AJ Styles has given his his body. He has given his life. He, he has dedicated everything he has. He's a former TNA champion. Like I said, competed in WCW. Made it to the bright lights of the WWE. Came within an eyelash of winning the Royal Rumble. Almost defeated Roman Reigns. Become the WWE champion. Become the United States champion. He's defeated John Cena. He's defeated Kevin Owens. He's defeated Sami Zayn. He has defeated a who's who in WWE. And, you know, viewers and subscribers, that is what's to be. Even Shane McMahon has went against AJ Styles. So, I mean, AJ Styles, I mean, he could have went off. AJ Styles, AJ Styles, the fact that he's going to commit two more years and then call it a day, you got to give him high praise and huge respect to AJ Styles because, like I said, with all the injuries and, you know, all the things that have been weighing down AJ Styles, um, you know, over over so many years. I mean, I'm sure there was when there was injuries and perhaps money issues, and I, I'm sure there was a lot of things. I'm sure it wasn't all you know peaches and cream for AJ Styles. I, I, let's just put it out there. But the fact that AJ Styles, you know, comments on his future about lasting another you know two years. I mean, you got you know the he has given us more time than his family. That's what this comes down to. When you're a professional wrestler, when you're a superstar, when you're under those bright lights, when you're specifically with the WWE, you have to commit more time, more passion, more devotion to that than anything in your entire life. And the fact that AJ Styles versus Nakamura is being rumored for WrestleMania 34 is absolutely huge. So viewers and subscribers, we talked about a lot. We talked about a lot of specifics. We talked about the future of the WWE, the UK division. We talked about um, Charlotte going against James Ellsworth. Um, we talked about SmackDown not looking so good at Survivor Series, but ultimately SmackDown's going to win the one match that matters most, and that's the traditional five-on-five -five match. But as always, in the WWE, things can change and plans can go in another direction. Viewers and subscribers, your comments and your opinions. Share my videos on Facebook and Twitter. More to come from the Brash and Brazen. I will not be overtaken. Sean V. Damon, remember to refresh my YouTube channel multiple times a day, every single day, so you're always in the know on all WWE. Today, tomorrow, the past, the present, and the future. More to come. Stay tuned.